Remember how sometimes I talk about when preparation meets opportunity? Well, today was one of those days for me. As part of the Coffee with Kelly Women Who Inspire series, I had the ability to interview Mary Chen, who is the co-founder of a company I admire and respect so much, Chen Medical. Mary, with, with your book, The Chronicles of Nai Nai, what do you wish readers will take away from this story most? Faith. I, I, do you know what? Without faith, without knowing there's a God who loves you, I don't know how to live day by day. I don't know how. I really don't. I keep asking myself, if somebody has no faith, they have no God, what they are, how they, what they can hold it. So you have experienced an incredible journey when you arrived in the U.S. You encountered some really challenging times, hence why you may not want to do it again, including homelessness. Can you share with our followers how that shaped you as a person? Uh, when it's like a, that homeless stick in my mind, it, it's just like a, um, it's keep reminding me about what I had to do with myself. So every time somebody asks me, you're homeless, the first thing that come to my mind is how I become homeless. Why I became homeless? And then I always remember to become a homeless because, of my, because God, pray to God, take everything away from my husband or my wife. And then, and then he rather be very poor with me, but have the wife who love God. In the beginning, remember you say about the pandemic during that time, that's how you start with this program. Yes. And then by talking to you about taking care of the patient, you know, like uh, during that time, pandemic, like uh, everything was shut down, right? And then yeah. patient cannot go to anywhere or something. And then we use, uh, we use a uh, telecom, right? To taking care of patient. Sure. Do you know during that time, we have, we, we have called love call. We call all our patients. A love call. Love call. We call that call love call. Wow. We assign the patient. We assign our caregiver. You call all the patients love call to see how they are doing it. It's like a, that is both way, right? If I love you, pretty 99% of you are going to love me back. So I just find out this is how that love cycle. And then I don't know how they come out that great word. It's called love call. Okay. It is a love call. Brilliant. It's a, it's a, it's a, it is a love call. Yes. And during that time, and actually, none of our patients were forgotten. They all know we are connected to them. We cannot see you as often as you want it, but we know there's a connection. If, and then that love call only takes us one week to execute every market. One week, within a week. Within a week, we come out that one and then big. First of all, we did not know it going to be last for two years, right? But we knew we need to do something. So in the end, almost for two years, love call. 